tickets. It is Sunday morning. The countdown for America is still ticking because I've got to get this bad boy done before I go away. We are back. Right, first job, straight away. No messing about. Time to get a load of insulation. All cut for the whole plot, really. You're gonna get it all cut now. Loads of 450 strip strips. I'll get them in between the wall ties right the way around, get this all insulated, both panels, then we can start packing them up. Go on. Right, there we go, we're all insulated, and I'm keeping these back 20 mil because we've got a thermobate to go in there, so that'll allow the thermobate to fit in that gap. Lovely. Now I've set myself a profile up on the gauge mark. Clamped at the top of a block, got my line round. Same here, clamped, set up onto a block. So that's all ready to roll now. Now the next thing we need to do is put a four inch damp down to stop any damp from the ground coming up. So I'm gonna run a four inch damp all the way around that. Then we can start laying, obviously using our perfect clips every course. We get this corner round. I've been given a bombshell, ladies and gentlemen. There's been a revision on the drawings. I'll show you on the drawing now, and as you can see from the old drawing, and you can see from the new drawing, we've got to make this one 100 mil either side less, 200 mil smaller, reduce it 100 mil either side. So, just one of them things. A little bit more is up. You know what, because it's a Sunday, I've just got 11. I'm thinking to myself, I don't want to blow myself out. I've been hard at it. I've got tomorrow, Monday, to get that side up. And then I'm waiting for scaffolders. So, I'm going to get that side up tomorrow. I've got to set out a few walls in here. Then Tuesday, when the scaffolders are here, I can crack on. Take this up all the way on the inside here. And then Thursday, Wednesday, I should be on the scaffold. I'm thinking two days on this plot, one day on that one. So, we're looking at Saturday, all finished, fingers crossed. Maybe Friday, but Saturday, fingers crossed. Right, now it's Monday morning. Started insulating this last panel. Got them bits up, just got to do around this corner. Get this bit insulated. I'm gonna get this all backed up. Then, the next little job, I'm gonna create, uh, change this window because of what I said earlier on, we've got an operation on the window. I'm gonna get this all sorted out. Then we're gonna set out the floor for the internal walls. I've got rake blocks in there ready to go. Probably not quite enough, but at least there's some in there. There we go, nicely insulated. Damp trays on. Bosh. That's not good. Absolutely pouring down with rain. Right, so now I've entered back into the bigger plot and I've marked out my internal walls, which there's a few of them. There's one here, one here, one here, then over the other side. We have one here and one here which lines through with this one, although it's got a few doorways in it. So yeah, you can see the plan of it now on the floor. That's roughly it. So, I've just cut all them blocks down to 150 because that's what we've got build up underneath, well actually 155. Build up to bring us up to floor level, finished floor level. So I'll get these all bedded on, then we'll put our damp tray on top of these. Then we go up to the top. 
Also, I'm going to be grinding out here and putting our tyres in because originally there wasn't any internal walls. Now there is. <laughs> so I've got to put a load of tyres in, keep these walls strong. There we go. That's all of them set out nice. Happy days. Got my wall tyres in the wall now. Four of my bits everywhere. Been cutting, pasted in all the spots for all the internal walls. So we're laughing now. Right, bang, we've got a profile set up now on this inside. So we're ready to pull these in. We've got my main man. My main man, Matty's here. He's doing some scaffolding with us. Oi, oi, Matty. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Where's the other fella? It's Talbot, ladies and gentlemen. The boys are here, man. They're sorting out the scaffold for old Tricky Ricky. So we're going to have another lift available very soon. getting up there now with it lovely I put this piece in here just to give this single standing one a bit of support as it goes up I don't want that falling over and the scaffolding is coming on nicely some height to it in here now ladies and gentlemen and the scaffold has been completed an absolute fine job by me old mate Talbot cheers bro nice to right. see you again man when will I see you again <laughs> lovely to see you bro cheers man Go. there's that one complete now we're on to the next one again it's the same thing profile up profile up line hooked round this time I've hooked it round there and I've hooked it round there easy peasy fresh this one in come on we're getting there there we go that one's complete now on to the last one of the day one, two, three, four and a half blocks wide, eight courses high, 44 blocks. Nah, four, 30, 36, 36 blocks I've got to bring in. I've got a few there. Let's get the rest of these in, get this laid off and go home. Oi, oi. Ran out of 
come up on course from the top. What a shame. Yes, guys and girls, we do know that lovely sound, don't we? But before we go, let's check out this scaffold. I thought it's done well, considering that was so narrow through there. We've got three boards, which is all right. We've got a board I can stack on. I've got two to walk down. Nice. Look at all them internal walls. Wow. Yes. Good stuff. The boys have done me proud. So guys and girls, of course, how long has he got? How long have I got until it's time to fly? So I better be quick. We are getting there now though. We really are. So well, ladies and gentlemen, if you've got anything out of this episode and you've enjoyed it, please don't forget, hit that thumbs up, hit the subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. But until then, have a great evening. Peace out and pow.